Hey everybody, it's Roll64 and welcome back to Let's Play The Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time. In the last episode we started a very long side quest, and in this episode hopefully we will finish it up. Now this isn't part of the side quest, but I do recommend doing this. And I think I'm going the wrong way. Take a bomb, blow this guy up. Wow, first shot. How could you do this to me? You're G you're you, you're Ganondorf's servant. Hear my name and tremble. I am Roland, hero of the Gorons. Well, that's weird. Last I checked, my name was Roland. Of course, it's not my real life name, but you get the idea. What? Your name is also Roland? Then you must be the legendary Dodongo Buster and hero Roland. My dad is Darunia. Do you remember him? Dad named me Roland after you because you're so brave. It's a cool name. I know it really is. I really like it. Me too. Roland, you're a hero to us Gorons. I'm so glad to meet you. Please give me your autograph. Sign it to my friend, Roland of the Gorons. Oh. I guess it's not a good time to ask you for this. Please help everyone. My dad, Darunia, went to the Fire Temple. A dragon is inside. If we don't hurry up, even my dad will be eaten by the dragons. Boo-hoo. You'd better try and calm him down if you can. Maybe he'll calm down if you ask... Maybe he'll calm down if you talk to him. What do you want to ask him? Uh, you have to ask him both things, so we're going to ask about the dragons first. A long time ago in a galaxy far, far away, there was an evil dragon named Volvagia living in this mountain. That dragon was very scary. He ate Gorons. Using a huge hammer, the hero of the Gorons, boom, destroyed it just like that. This is a myth from long ago, but it's true. I know because my dad is a descendant of the hero. Boo-hoo. Better calm him down. We're going to ask about the Gorons. Everybody was taken to the Fire Temple. While my dad was out, Ganondorf's followers came and took them all away. All of them will be eaten by, Vol by Volvagia. Dad said that Ganondorf revived Volvagia. As a warning to those who might oppose him, Ganondorf is going to feed them all to Volvagia. Dad went to the fire temple all by himself to save him. <coughs> oh, there's that sneeze. To save everyone. Please help, Roland. I'll give you this heat-resistant tunic. And you got the Goron tunic, the final tunic in the game. The third of three. This heat-resistant tunic is adult size, so it won't fit a kid. Going to a hot place? No worry. And then he opens up the shop in Darunia's place. Okay, so... You know what, let's go ahead and try it on. Alright, it looks nice, I like it. Alright. No, that's the exit. I don't want to go up the exit. Here it is. Here it is. Or not. Never mind, that's for something else. Alright, now where is it? Oh, pfft. I was next to it. I was... Well, not next to it, but you get the idea. Well, remember this guy? He said he'll give us something after five or six years? Well, it's been seven years. I just completed a small weapon. How about it? How about buying this knife for 200 rupees? And you got the giant's knife. Hold it with both hands and use B to attack. It's so long, you can't use it with a shield. And we're out 200 rupees. 
So, let's try out the giant's knife. Alright, this is awesome here. Oh, I love this. Oh! It's broken! It's broken! Ah! Oh! I want my money back, you freeloader! I don't have 200 rupees! I got scammed! I'm so mad, I'm gonna jump into the volcano now! So I'll meet you guys there, at the volcano, hang on! Oh, I just need to take out my rage. I'm gonna throw myself into a game now. You, look at this. Look at this. My brother opened a new store. It's Medigoron's blade store. However, I am better at making blades. Highly and Carpenters praise me for my skills. I'm not lying. Really? I got this from a Hylian Carpenter. Wanna take a look at it? That broken knife is surely my work. I really want to repair it, but... Because of yesterday's eruption, my eyes are irritated. There are fine eye drops in Zora's domain. You will find them if you go to see King Zora. Please go get the eye drops. Yeah, sure. Of course. I'll help a I'll help a guy out. Yeah, all right. All right, guys. I'm not going to throw myself in the volcano. I am going to meet you at Zora's I'm gonna meet you at Zora's domain. Oh crap! Ah! Run, 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 run! Uh, I'm gonna die! I'm gonna die! I'm gonna die! Uh... 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 I'll see you guys then. Okay guys, so we're here in Zora's Domain, and we're gonna get the eye drops for the guy, because he really needs them. Here's a prescription, Doctor. Oh, this is, well, hmm, eye drops. You might say we have them, you might say we don't. We do have the ingredients. If you take the ingredients to the doctor at the Lake Laboratory, he can make the drops for you. But you need to deliver them fresh. Can you make it before they spoil? Yes. And so, you used a prescription and received an eyeball frog. Be quick and deliver it to Lake Hylia while it's cold. So, it's another one of them timed missions. Again, we have three minutes, so... I'm just gonna... do this regularly. Cloud over Death Mountain. That doesn't look like no cloud. Looks like a ring of death. But anyway. So yeah. Um I might actually speed this up and play music. Yeah, I'm gonna do that, so uh hang on.
Alright, the music should have stopped by now. And this is the first real introduction to Lake Hylia. So I'm just gonna park my horse like a car. And let's go in. Lakeside Laboratory. Dude. There we go. Oh! Oh, wow. I haven't seen an eyeball frog like this since Zora's the main froze over. These eyeballs are so delicious. Tonight I'll cook fried eyeballs for the first time in a long time. Woo hoo 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 Such great stuff. Please say thank you to King Zora. Eh, what? These are for making Big Goron's eye drops? Oh, how disappointing. You should have said so in the first place. I don't know what accent I'm talking through. Yeah. Here it is. This medicine doesn't have any preservatives in it, so it won't last at long at this temperature. Run as fast as you can to Death Mountain. You're young. You can do it. You traded the eyeball frog for the world's finest eye drops. Hurry, take them to Big Goron before they go bad. Alright, so I'm going to speed up and play music again. And now you have four minutes on this one, so... And you have plenty of time, so hang on. Alright guys, I think this is a good time to start talking again. Uh, when you start climbing up the mountain, like climbing up where all those sculptures were, um, I recommend you have at least 30 seconds. Really? You brought the eye drops? I am so relieved. I'm going to use them right now. Falcon Punch! Wow! This is stimulating! It's working great! Now I can get back to my blade business. My work is not very consistent, so I'll give this to you so you won't forget. After a few days, please return. Wait, just be... Wait, just wait patiently. The Big Goron Sword. You got the claim check for it. You can't wait for the sword to be completed. So? Good lord. My recording says we've been going for about 23 minutes. Of course, I know that's not the actual time. It's probably somewhere about 15. Maybe. I don't know. But what you want to do is play the Sun Song, I believe... Six times, if you start at night, probably five.
so let's see, for me, this is number three. And then five. I made this trade for the claim check. That sword is my finest work. You handed in the claim check and got the big Goron sword. This blade was forged by a master smith and won't break. So pretty much, it's basically the knife, except it will not break, ever. With a much longer range. Unfortunately, you can't use your shield. But that's going to be all for this episode of Let's Play The Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time. So in the next episode, we will... Um, do some other stuff. Maybe start a temple. I don't know. Either way, I will see you guys then. This is World64 signing off. This is golden. They'll never suspect a thing. Stupid windows. Ah, this is the perfect scam.